difficult day for a North Texas community after a 15-year-old student was killed in a terrible accident over the weekend. CBS 11's Brittany Jeffers joins us live near the 9th grade center in Weatherford where administrators are working to help students with their grief. Brittany. And Karen, definitely a difficult day. So many in this community grieving this loss. I found out today that here at the ninth grade center, they do have counselors available, also at the high school as well. Uh, administrators also tell me that they're going to be checking in on the students today, speaking with them to make sure that they're doing okay. So administrators with the ninth grade center sent me a message about an hour ago. It was the message that they shared with parents, calling Ryan a wonderful young man who loved his engineering class and enjoyed band saying that the 15-year-old had many friends and he will be deeply missed by students and staff. Now, 15-year-old Ryan Sager's family tells us that he was headed to the movie on Friday night with friends, but he never made it home. Instead, the family was notified by police that the teenager tried to cross Interstate 20 in Weatherford on his bike and was hit by a truck. The guy tried to stop, but it was too little, too late. And we don't blame the driver. And we don't blame his friend. He made a bad decision. And police tell us that the driver stayed at the scene and will not face any charges. Meanwhile, there is a GoFundMe page that's been established to try to help out with funeral expenses. If you'd like more information on that, we've included it in a link on our website. Reporting live here in Weatherford, I'm Brittany Jeffers, CBS 11 News.